Carmine Caridi is an American television and film actor. He has appeared in a wide variety of roles over the past 30 years. He lives in West Hollywood. Career. His most notable film roles are Carmine Rosetta in The Godfather Part II and Albert Volpe in The Godfather Part III. He is one of three actors to play two different roles in The Godfather films. According to studio executive Robert Evans in his 1994 memoir The Kid Stays in the Picture, Caridi was director Francis Ford Coppola's first choice for the role of Sonny Corleone, but Evans insisted on James Kahn because Caridi was too tall to play opposite Al Pacino. Caridi also appeared in the cult movie classic Kiss Meets the Phantom of the Park, playing amusement park manager Calvin Richards and appeared as Sam Giancana in the 1992 film Ruby. On television he portrayed Dan Valenti, the boss of Phyllis Lindstrom on the TV series Phyllis from 1976 to 1977. In 1978, he appeared as Di Carlo in the episode The Intimate Friends of Janet Wilde of the NBC crime drama series The Eddie Capra Mysteries. Between 1982 and 1983, Caridi played Angelo Martelli, Bruno Martelli's father, in the TV series Fame. Caridi went on to play Detective Vince Scottily in the television series NYPD Blue from 1993 to 1999. Piracy Incident On January 13, 2004, the Academy of Motion Picture Arts and Sciences announced that it had identified a pirate copy of the film Something's Gotta Give, circulated illegally on the Internet, as carrying markings identifying it as coming from a video sent to Caridi in his role as an Oscar voter. Pirate copies of The Last Samurai, Mystic River, Big Fish and Master and Commander, The Far Side of the World were also said to have been traced to Caridi. The FBI subsequently began an investigation into the affair. Later that month, the FBI charged Russell Sprague of Homewood, Illinois with criminal copyright infringement. Federal authorities allege that for at least three years, Caridi had given Sprague his screener copies of approximately 60 movies seeking consideration for the Academy Awards. According to the FBI affidavit, Caridi said that he sent his screeners via Federal Express to Misty, Sprague, who gave him FedEx boxes, pre-addressed labels and an account number. Caridi denied receiving money from Sprague, telling the FBI he believed that Sprague was a film buff. Caridi and Sprague were sued by Sony and Time Warner on civil charges of copyright infringement. The studios are suing in the United States District Court for the Central District of California in Los Angeles, seeking damages of a minimum of $150,000 per movie, with hundreds of individual violations alleged. While awaiting trial on criminal charges, Sprague died of a suspected heart attack. The Academy of Motion Picture Arts and Sciences announced on February 3, 2004 that it was expelling Caridi for violating his agreement to safeguard their screeners, making him the first Academy member to be expelled under its new anti-piracy policy. Selected Filmography The Gang That Couldn't Shoot Straight Crazy Joe The Gambler The Godfather Part Two, Hollywood Man Car Wash the Chief Detective, Kiss Meets the Phantom of the Park, The In-Laws, Prince of the City, Brewster's Millions, Summer Rental, The Money Pit, Split Decisions, Havana, The Godfather Part 3, Femme Fatale, Bugsy, Ruby, Top Dog.